I'm Terry Oracle, and this is news for September 2022. We have Blue Avatar Tarot coming out on Kickstarter. I assume by the time you're watching this, it will be out. Link in the description to get this. I've used this on stream almost every day for quite some time, and it has an amazing reaction. A lot of people are requesting it. A lot of people want it. And as with all Push Kitty Kickstarters, you can get some of the older decks, too. You can get maybe the little Buddha, get some little wizards. There's a lot of great decks that you can pick up. Anyway, be sure to check that out. Link in the description for going to get that. Now, some people are asking, they're like, wait a minute, Elder Scrolls Tarot, you said you were the Skyrim super fan, but you don't have, and I realize that. The reason I, <laughs> look at it, I mean, the miners, they skimped out on the miners. Thank you, Wicked Moonlight, for showing this deck, because I do not want it, I'm sorry. Uh, that maybe make me a bad person, but, uh, when you skimp out on the miners, because Skyrim is the game of all time. And the fact that you can't be bothered to go look up to all the tons of Skyrim lore, uh, dungeons, dragon stuff that's going on. You can't do any of that. All you can do is just Photoshop stuff together like this. And uh, I, I guess that's a shouts. Is that shouts? I don't know. Anyway, but it's been a, sorry, it's been a while. Anyway, uh, so much stuff. You can't bother to do any of it. I'm not going to support your uh, tarot deck. I'm sorry. I mean, maybe y'all need to pick it up. Skyrim Tarot is out. It's been out since the end of July. So I, I you know, I just didn't pick it up. Garbage Pail Kids, though, this looks pretty good. This is fun. It looks wild. It looks weird. This is definitely a, a deck that everybody must have, in my opinion. This is coming out very, very soon. Reasonable price at 20 bucks as well. You know, you can get the Garbage Pail Calendar, the Garbage Pail Cookbook. Um, ooh, Garbage Pail Cookbook. That just doesn't sound appetizing. But hey, uh, it, anyway, it looks great. This is coming out right now so get your copy right now you must have this deck stranger things is another one that you must have i mean you know casey gilly is back they're also making the dc tarot which i'm kind of concerned about i'm uh, not gonna lie i'm kind of concerned about this stranger thing is a series on netflix if you don't know and uh you know we have the glow on the outside of all the characters like in the star trek tarot so that's kind of concerning me. That's kind of concerning me indeed. We have the monster, the strands monster. So uh, yeah, pick this up if you're interested. 25 bucks. It is number one new release in horror television. Indeed. You want to get that. Lord of the Rings, the same thing. Lots and lots of movie references, uh, TV references coming out, and uh, hey, that's all right. Oh no, they're advertising the Star Trek deck. Do not get that. Who uh, was the Star Trek deck? Was that Casey Gilly too? Uh, no, that was. Yeah, do, was I? Do not get that deck. Lord of the Rings, though. Hopefully, I mean, it looks decent. It looks decent. Hopefully, it is. Uh, oh man, it's going to be non-illustrated miners here, but. Man, I don't know what's the deal with the non-illustrated miners. I, I guess that's a new thing. That's going to be a permanent? I don't know. Um, but Lord of the Rings, you definitely want to pick that up. There's a Hobbit tarot that I love. The love, love it. Let me show you that one real quick. We got to go. We got to go do that one. Hobbit tarot. Now that, if you're interested, the Hobbit tarot. Okay, that's expensive because uh, it's out of, out of print. Uh, I have the Hobbit tarot, and that is highly, highly great. It was I just made that. I just made that word up. I made that combo highly great. Okay. Anyway, it is fantastic. Um, but yes, if you can get it for a decent price, it is fantastic. It has illustrated miners. I know that's a sin nowadays, but it does have it. That is a great alternative if you're not interested in the Lord of the Rings. One World Tarot though has piqued my interest. This looks really good. I have high hopes for it. I love the art. I kind of love where they're going with it. It just looks good. That looks really good. So Wonder World Tarot. I'm very excited about this. That comes out October 4th. And you need to get it. I mean, you're talking 304 page accompanying book, possibly for 25 bucks for 300 page accompanying book. 
That's going to be very nice indeed. That is going to be nice. Look at this. Look at these cards. A little bit of a border. Look how thick that, but Jesus, look how thick that book is. That is a thick book. That is massive. I love the deal we're getting on this. Uh, graphics look fantastic. The borders are there, but they're not just in your face. You get a, uh, a just a tome of a book. Look at that, man. That's like a sit down and read it for a month book. I love it. I love for 25 bucks. I already pre-ordered this. Can't wait for this to be in my hand. 420 tarot deck. Some people like it. Some people don't. The the big red eyes is kind of over the top for me. It, it's kind of kind of over the top for me. Maybe this is something you like. You know, I've been waiting for this thing for my whole life. Maybe um, I'm, I'm going to pass on this one j just because it just looks it's a little too over the top for me. But uh, if you want to pick that up, that is coming September the 13th. We also have Contemplative Tarot, a Christian Guide to the Cards. I'm kind of interested. You do have a lot of religious references within the cards. I mean, you have a lot of angels. You have a lot of just basic uh, re religious references within the cards. So I'm kind of curious at, uh, at what we're doing in this book. I'm kind of curious, right? Christian Guide to the Cards. I'm just kind of curious where they're going with it. It is only for uh, 11 bucks on the Kindle. It's 368 pages. So I'm going to probably pick this up, just read it, give you a book review kind of on it. I'm just kind of interested where they're going to go with that. Fairies and Magical Creatures. Number one release in mysticism. It is the uh, tarot deck for $17.99, which is a nice price. That is a nice price indeed. I'm kind of curious. You get a manual only, I don't know how many pages that is. Uh, 78, I assume that talked about the cards. Right away, deck quality. Uh, creatures to well-known. We got the, uh, if you're new to fan, right away, deck quality, tarot, cards, witchcraft, and magical folklore. Uh, okay, I mean, it looks okay. I'm just kind of interested to see how the, all the cards look. But uh, I'm kind of excited about this. I don't mind, you know, sort of checking this out and seeing where they're going with that, especially. All Seeing Heart Oracle. Let's take a look at this. This looks pretty cool. Uh, sort of a, yeah, sort of a wild look there on stuff. You got the storm. You got the Heart of Shadows. Uh, sort of Heart of Sorrows. You get 64 pages. I don't know if that's 64 cards. Uh, 25 bucks if you're interested in this. Also have coming out Botanica, the Herbalist Tarot. Well, I'm kind of interested to see what this looks like. Uh, that looks interesting, I guess. Uh, Botanica. Wow, look at the edges. That's nice. Nice box. Nice edges. Eh, I'm kind of interested to see what this looks like in a, in a real-life situation. Uh, it is 78 cards. Uh, Herbalizer, foil-stamped, foil gilled edges cards. Nice. Three and a quarter, 4.15 on premium heavyweight card stock. Wow, that's a lot. That is nice. Um, I don't know why it's currently av unavailable. Uh, is it out of stock? Are they having issues kind of getting it in stock or something? I'm not sure, but I'm interested in the price. Quality looks like it's there. Let's see the price. Goddesses Among Us, an Oracle deck with 36 cards for 25 bucks. Ouch. We need more than 36 cards, guys. Need more than 36 cards to make me happy. Uh, yeah, there you go. We got a cute book. You got cute cards. Um, let's kind of see where we're going with this. 128 page guidebook with 36 cards for 25 bucks, I, I guess. Man, we need more cards. I mean, how hard is it to make more cards? Lorenzi Tarot. Let's look at the image. Uh, okay. That looks interesting. We need more images than that. I, I, don't, I just don't understand why people don't give you more images of some of these cards. I'm kind of just kind of interested with that. Let's look at U.S. Games over here and see where we're going here. All right, let's look at U.S. Games and see the Lorenzi Tarot. Maybe we have more images over here here we go we actually have images okay um wow that's pretty that is nice that is nice it's a shame that amazon doesn't print these images that is that is cool looking like i need this this is really cool looking 
I really like this. Let me see what they did with the miners. Do we have some miners? We have a knight. We have an eight of cups. Um, mm, okay. We have a five of pentacles. So this looks like sort of a images sort of combined together, I guess. But, I mean, I'm just saying that looks really good. So, I'm not going to lie. That looks really good. I kind of like that. Now I'm kind of lost to where I was. There we go. Lorenzi Terra. 30 bucks kind of hurts. I know U.S. Games has the occasional sale. I would pick it up during the sale. Dark Like Oracle coming out end of a September. Let's look at those images. That is a pretty card. Ooh, look at this. Alone with myself. Oh, my. Uh, full Moon. We got that. We got bad. That is pretty. These, these are some pretty cards. These are really attractive cards. Uh, I may have to pick this up. I mean, this looks like a really good Oracle deck. That looks really, really good. Uh, 22 bucks. How many cards do we get? Uh, 40 cards. That's not too bad. 76 card, uh, 76 page guidebook. 40 cards. That looks all right. That looks all right. Uh, let's look at Clarity Tarot. 25 bucks. You got a 176 page guidebook that comes with it, apparently. Um, wow. That's cool looking. That's nice. I kind of like that. Well, you know, how to interpret it with love, how to interpret it with money for each individual card. It's kind of cool. I like that. 25 bucks coming out end of September. This looks like something I'm going to buy. That does look pretty good. Looks like something I'm going to buy. I like the artwork. The Ten of Cups is Illustrated Minders. I like kind of the translations on there about, you know, this is sort of for love, money, what it's going to be. Timid love, money, creative venture. You know, I kind of like that. It looks like we have some gilded, gold gilded edges. It looks good. It looks pretty good for 25 bucks. I'm going to pick this up. I also have the Chibi Tarot. Y'all have been waiting for this one for sure. We have lots and lots of images for this now. And, uh, you know, it looks, it looks cute. This looks kind of like my style. It's just like cute. It's fun. Throw it on the table. Have some fun with it. That's coming out end of September. Kawaii Chibi. A lot of y'all love the Kawaii Tarot that I have now, right? So this is going to be another one in that kind of collection. Sacred Feminine Oracle Cards. Let's take a look at this. This looks pretty cool. Um, I'm kind of interested to see more cards. We don't really have more cards. I mean, it's coming out like soon. I'm surprised a lot of people just don't post the cards. Anyway, how many? You get 33. Uh, ouch, that is almost no cards. Uh, it's cheap. But you only get 33 cards. Um, Angel Oracle Cards, another one, the 33 cards. Is this the same person? It looks like the same person. This looks like the same. Okay, uh, Casper Bousset. Uh, and Casper and Blanc. Yeah, Casper looks like that they are not the friendly ghost. They are just sort of cranking out the decks here with 33 cards. I'd rather have, you know, it's only 15 bucks. Get it if you need it. Metaphysical Cannabis. This is the one that's much better than the other Cannabis or, uh, Tarot. This looks like it's really thought out well. Like, look how thick that box is. That's nice. It looks like a slide out insert on the bottom here. Um, and it looks like that, you know, it's just going to be very thick cards. It's got a book that comes with it. Just that looks high quality. That looks really good. No borders. Uh, looks fantastic. You got great art. Uh, the cards look like they're thick. I mean, that, that's fairly thick right there. I mean, let's, let's scroll up here. Of course, I can't. Uh, okay, but that's fairly, that's fairly thick down there. And uh, that's, what, that's what she said. And that's fairly thick down there. So it looks like it's going to be good quality cards. It looks like it's going to be just a deck that I need. Look, great art. Beautiful art over here. This is a deck that you got to have. I mean, this is a no-brainer for me. Especially for $22. I pre-ordered this long ago. I'm still excited about it. The OK Tarot. You know, it's not great. It's not bad. It's just OK. Uh, this comes out September 20th, although we have a gazillion ratings. Either it already came out or it's a reprint. Either way, if you're OK with some OK Tarot, then you can get yourself an OK Tarot deck. I'm not getting this. I'm not. That is not. That is not. I don't mind simplistic tarots, but that's a little too much. 
That is the laziest looking tarot deck I've ever seen in my life, quite possibly. But yeah, it's a simple deck. It is indeed. Everybody loves it. Y'all can keep loving it because that ain't for me. But if you want it, apparently it may be a reprint. Uh, let's see the ratings. How back? It, from 2020. So it's a reprint. Uh, okay, but it's back, you know, it's okay, and they wanted to bring it back because it's okay. Cats rule the earth, a tarot deck with cats ruling the earth. Cute art, a bit minimalistic on the art, just sort of insert cat in scene, but uh, yeah, uh, it's cute. I have so many cat tarots, this is not something that I need in my life, but I mean, hey, if this is something you want, you've been waiting for it, you've been itching for a cat tarot that costs 30 freaking dollars, then feel free to pick that up. Uh, uh, instead, I'm going to pick up the Sufi tarot from uh, Ayeda Hussein. This looks really good. Really, really, really good. This looks really, really good. Wow. Like the artwork is just really sort of captivating me here. I love it. I love it. This is, looks really good. Uh, but yeah, 30 bucks. <laughs> First of its kind, East meets, East meets West. That's easy for me to say. You got to make a tool for yourself, reflection, healing, transformation. I needed a guidebook for transformation at this point. Just say 192 pages. That looks good. That looks something I need in my life. Look at the art on this. Wow. That is fantastic. That is just fantastic. Are you ready to begin the journey? I am ready. I want to begin my journey now. I want these in my possession right now. I don't want to wait till September 20th. So nice. Wiser Tarot, a new classic edition. I don't know. I'm getting kind of burned out on Rider Waite Smith classic reprints. Um, okay. All right. Oh, Jesus. What? That is. What? That, that does not look good. That looks like they really butchered the colors, man. You have a bright, vibrant, beautiful car. Let's butcher the colors. Uh, let's reduce. Let's reduce the saturation on all these cards. Really? Let's reduce the saturation on all the cards. And um, yeah, let's do that. Let's make it a little bit hazier, blurrier. Um, not my thing, man. I mean, maybe this is you. Maybe this is, you know, I need this in my life for 21 bucks. Uh, if you're interested, it is a new edition of the classic. Well, there's so many better ones out there, in my opinion. Wild Woman Oracle. I love me a wild woman, especially one with an oracle deck. Uh, kind of cute. Why did we remove the color? I don't know. Would have liked it with the color. It's cute. 25 bucks. 144 page guide, but 44 cards. I would look elsewhere, but that's just me. Oracle of the Witch, reclaim your birthright. I've been meaning to reclaim my birthright. I finally can with this very, very, uh, kind of cute. Kind of cute. A little two color theme, not really my thing. It's cute. Uh, 44 cards, 24 bucks. Seems like a good deal. If you want to pick that up, go ahead and reclaim your birthright. Deep, dark, and dangerous, just like my bathroom. We have the deep, dark, and dangerous oracle. 44 cards, 128 page book. That looks pretty. That looks really pretty. Like the artwork is fantastic on this. Somebody knows how to Photoshop. This looks very good, very attractive, and I like it. I may end up picking this up. Wow, look at that. Man, there's a lot of good artwork out there, man. A lot of good artwork. 22 bucks seems pretty reasonable for this. I mean, 44 cards is acceptable. It's when you get down to 30 cards, 33 cards. I don't think that works. Godfather Tarot. Insert your favorite Godfather Tarot, or Godfather quote. It looks like there's scenes from the movies. Um, is this an oracle? No, it's a tarot deck. So what the world, the magician, we got a uh, in the cards. So let's look at Al Pacino here. We got strength. Man, this looks terrible. Um, that just does not look good. I mean, if you have the IP for that, why not do scenes from the movies or something like that, right? I mean, you got the IP, why not do scenes from the movies, in my opinion, right? 
that just looks really minimalistic here. Um, I'm going to have to pass on this one. If you love The Godfather and you're really interested in getting this, though, I mean, hey, October the 18th, it's coming out. Don't forget the DC Tarot. I'm kind of concerned about this. This is in November. Um, I mean, I'm really concerned about this. Uh, it just doesn't... So it's not going to have illustrated miners. It's going to have just a two green lanterns over here with the two of pentacles, not of swords, queen of cops, five of cops. Uh, 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 okay. I mean, all right. I guess. Sure, if you're interested in that, pick it up. Let's go to Llewellyn. We have the lustrous Lenormand. It is from Cheryl Marchetti, who I thought retired, but maybe not. We got the sun over here. We got the dog. We got the labyrinth. So, uh, yeah, everything from Cheryl is very pretty, very good. It looks good. looks nice. Um, this coming out is for $30 freaking dollars. That is a lot. That is $28 plus tax, $30, bucks, 208 pages. I guess that's the guide that comes with it. Coming out in November, if you're into that, Lenormand, it looks like a good one. Trick or Treat Tarot is already released. We've seen it on the stream. So, uh, I liked it. This, in my opinion, I mean, you know, in my opinion, this is a contender for deck of the year. It's just very well illustrated. Fantastic book. Uh, great card quality. Every All the boxes are checked for just a complete win. Notoria, Tarot in Light. Uh, yeah, it's coming out in November, and man, does it look good. It looks really, really, really good. I'm thrilled about this deck. This is one of the decks that I'm just like very much anticipating and ready to go with that. Now, you know my book called Tarot Combos Made Easy. No, no, it's Tarot Combos, Mastering Tarot Combos. There you go. Now we have Easy Tarot Combos. Not coming out until next year. How to Connect the Cards for Insightful Readings. Uh, but yeah, so there you go. Here's how to connect the cards. Now, I'm kind of curious as to where they go on this one. So uh, yeah, if you want my book, link in the description to get my book for only 8 bucks. So you don't got to pay 20 bucks. Uh, but yeah, I'm kind of curious, right? Polarity type, uh, predictive readings, applied meetings, visual prompts, sharing keywords. Uh, I'm kind of curious as to what they share in this. Anyway, Water Temple Oracle. This looks pretty. This looks very pretty. I'm kind of excited about where they're going with this one. It is 27 bucks. Let's take a look at some of the cards here. We already kind of saw it. We got that card, that card. Lady of the Lake, we got a nice back here. Very attractive deck. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, very attractive deck. Uh, I like it, it's 28 bucks. I'm not sure how many cards you get. Case quantity, no, I don't want a case of cards. I just want the cards. 44 cards, not bad, not bad at all. 27 bucks is kind of expensive. I guess that's the new norm though. Dark Side of Tarot, I pre-ordered this like a decade ago. I'm waiting for my copy. This is expensive, this is... <laughs> This is $38 if you want it, but uh, I just like it. It looks good. It's interesting. Uh, it is black and white, but sure does look good. $37 bucks is outrageously expensive. Wait for the Llewellyn uh, quarterly sale where they take 35% off anything you want and then pick it up, in my opinion. We got the Spiritual Tarot deck. This looks good. Waiting for this one, too. This one's coming out moderately soon here. Um, when is it coming out? Moderately soon, November. Let's take a look at the cards a little closer up here. Uh, I mean, yeah, this is something I need to have. I like it. It looks cool. It looks really cool. Uh, I got to have this. Spiritual Tarot deck. I need it in my life. Siddhartha Tarot. I need this in my life, too. Really cool looking. Like, they did some great art here. This is very, very pretty. Uh, I like it. It has a lot of sort of in-depth, uh, I guess, sort of meanings here. It looks very, very good. I like it a lot. Uh, Pre-ordered, it's only 25 bucks. Visually striking, indeed. We got the Steampunk Art Nouveau. Not really my thing, but maybe it's yours. Um, I don't know. I'm just kind of done with Steampunk. I mean, I like steampunk when it was first out kind of thing. 
I'm just kind of done with steampunk. I mean, does that make me a bad person? Does that make me a terrible person? I'm just kind of done with it. Uh, muted colors. It's kind of dark for me. Uh, which, I mean, steampunk might as well. But yeah. Tarot therapy. Harness the healing powers. Um, okay. I mean, I can harness the healing powers. How many pages we got in there? I want to see all the details. Uh, apparently, I can't see the page count. It is... Not a page count here either. Is because did I have the oh I have the Kindle. All right, let's do the paperback. Let's do the paperback. Two hundred fifty six pages. Harness the healing power of the deck. Already has many ratings. Pick it up if you want to harness the healing power of the deck. Uh, it is coming out soon, but we already have ratings for things that aren't out. So I don't understand. Uh, June thirteenth, twenty twenty three. Mm, I'm not sure what's going on with that. Uh, I guess if you want to heal then have yourself a healing party there. And uh, the Crowley Tarot. Now, I'm kind of curious where this is going. Where are we going here? So we just have a... No, there's no way the deck is that thick. That is a little exaggerated there. Unless it's made of, like, wood. There's no way the deck is that thick. The Sun, Ace of Cups, the Emperor. So it's a rework of the uh, Thoth, okay, the Crowley Tarot, we have that with the Emperor, we got the Wheel, so it's a rework of the cards uh, with a small book. I pick it up just because I like the, the, the Thoth enough to where I'm kind of interested where they go with it, but yeah, so we have the Crowley Tarot, I know the OTO is still around, and they are very protective of their copyright, so I'm curious as to how how much overlap you do have with the Thoth. She Sirens Oracle. Um, that's the only image that I get. 42 cards. A little light on the card count. Comes out next year, but I wanted to show it to you just because it was in there. Now, off to... Off to Kickstarter. Monsoon Tarot is pretty exciting. It's pretty exciting for me. I posted this on my page. The graphics, the artwork are just amazing. This looks so good. Uh, it looks really, really good. And I'm very excited about this deck. This looks so good. This looks really, really good. Like the artwork is so captivating to me. And I realize that artwork is one of those things where you either love it or you hate it. Uh, very subjective. But it's just captivating to me. Like this. That's just captivating. Like what's going on there, right? <coughs> Excuse me. Very captivating and very cool looking. It's like, what's going on here kind of thing. I like it. Uh, the Now, be aware, the collector's edition and the standard edition are very similar. You only get... So, the collector's edition, the only difference is a laser gilded edge and the foiling photochromic ink. So, this is what you're paying for with the special edition. Um... The guidebook is included, which I like. There are cloths that you can get here and bags. And I'm startled that there's no pictures of either. So I know if you're a previous backer of their stuff, you do get a cloth and bag for free. If not, you got to pay. But normally when you have a, a Kickstarter extra, like a cloth or a bag, they'll show a picture of it. I don't see it. And, I mean, I can throw a really crappy cloth into my Kickstarter if you want, not show a picture of it, and just say, look, you get a cloth in a bag. But if it's a good cloth in a bag, you need to put a picture of it, in my opinion. I went ahead and backed it, but I did the standard edition because I get the cloth in the bag free. I didn't really want to pay for the other. Cute Rabbit Tarot is cute. Same people that did the Luna Bear Tarot. Um, I believe this is, already, this is on their Etsy site, so you can like, get it now. The, these people do have a habit of posting tarot decks that you can already get on their Etsy site on Kickstarter. You know, sort of drum up some money. I don't blame them. And it does look cute. Good news is the minute the Kickstarter is done, normally they just ship it out right then. At least they did on mine. Surprisingly, only 27 backers. It is cute. I mean, it is cute indeed. So if you want this, it is available on their Etsy. Let's go to, let's go to, to Etsy real quick. Etsy Cute Rabbit uh, Tarot. See if we can find it. Maybe it's there, and there it is. Cute Rabbit Tarot for Etsy. Uh, Luna, cute Bunny Tarot, maybe. 
cute rabbit tarot, uh, chubby bun tarot, I don't know, I don't know, anyway, you can search, maybe find, I mean, you know, go ahead and back to Kickstarter if you want it, they did ship my other deck very quickly, so that's going to be something that you can kind of research on your own there, witchy magic tarot, this is another one that looked really good, look at this, look at Jesus, look at this, Look at this. That is nice. Wow. Wow. That looks so good. That looks so good. All right. Illustrate me some miners, my friend. Illustrate me some miners. Don't disappoint. Don't disappoint me. Where are the miners? We got the majors. Yeah, deck specification. That's fine. I want to see some miners. Where are the miners? When, I don't want a random card. I want to see miners. Where are the miners? Oh, man, that is not an attractive bag. That is not, a, that, wow, that is not a bag that I would buy. Luxury candle, that's fine. I don't see miners. Um, kind of concerned, I guess. Is that, uh, no, kind of concerned. Kind of concerned, not going to lie. I want to see some miners. Maybe they accidentally, no. Maybe they accidentally put it, no. Um, I got to choose which one. It does say 78 cards. It's an attractive deck, but if they skimped on the miners, let's go ahead and watch the video together here. Let me see. Let's see. Is that going to play? Of course, the video is not going to play. Do I have to reload it for the video to play? Um, I want to see a video. Wow, that's going to be loud. Witchy Magic Tarot. Um, okay. All right. All right. Wow, that's a very fast flip through there. Um, okay. Okay. I don't know. I'll do more research here and uh, see on the miners. I'm sure it's probably there. I'm sure it's probably there. Let's full screen it and look. Let's full screen it and look together. I don't know what we're doing. Can we show some cards? I don't want to see the back that many times. I just don't want to see the back. We have justice. We have a lot of cards. We have the star. Kind of getting worried here, my friends. Uh, let's skip to the next one. 78 Magic Tarot is already completed. If you want to get it, I'm sure that they will have it on their website. But uh, that's very attractive, very pretty. Missed it, but it's the way it goes. And we got the Lorenzi Tarot. There we go. And that is it for news. And did you know I have a Patreon? That's right. You get a lot of stuff for it. Not a lot of money. Okay. For five bucks, you get 20 hours of Create Your Tarot course. I teach you detailed how to draw animals detailed how to draw digitally i walk you through the application i walk you through how to make it i walk you through oil painting examples i got uh, pastel examples i got color pencil i got everything how to draw your own tarot cards because it's a good income source i'll be honest with you that's a really good income source and if you can draw realistic animals you can draw your neighbor's dog what have you they'll pay you 60 70 100 bucks for that behind the readings every week if you're wondering why i said what i said i tell you 10 percent uh, why i said what i said in my streams I tell you exactly why, what we're looking at. I go through details. 10% off everything in my store. Hey, that's worth the five bucks alone. I mean, if you're going to buy something, right? You get your name in my tarot decks, books. You get the name in the video credits. You also get a free Lenormand digital deck and a cloth. So you can go print it out. And that is on screen now for you to look at. As well as, if you want to dump 10 bucks in, you get everything over here, plus a weekly live stream. You get an hour with me once a week in a live stream. You want to ask me a question? Hey, why did you say that? I want to help on this. I want to help on this. I'm here for you. Live stream every week. Ask me anything you want. They're all uh, archived off, too, so you can watch previous ones. I teach you details, deep details. Deep details about tarot cards, how to read, what to do, etc. If you want me to do anything, I'll do what. If you want to see a magic trick, <laughs> whatever you want to see, I mean, I'm live streaming. I mean, between me and you. So ask me anything. This is private to Patreon. You also get all my digital books and audio books for 10 bucks. You get all the digital books and audio books. That's a steal. That is an easy, uh, easy way to go there. Now, if you want to go 20 bucks a month, you get a monthly, a 20-minute private reading with me. That's a dollar a minute. That's extremely, extremely reasonable. All of this is available to you right now. Go to my Patreon. Link in the description. 
and become a supporter. It helps me uh, make more videos. It helps me just make content that you want to see. It helps me a lot. So please, if you want to support me, I will reimburse you with a lot of stuff. I mean, it's not like you're just throwing money at me and hoping for the best. You're, you're getting things back. So I greatly appreciate your support. And thank you for watching this video. I will see you next time.